Hey guys, welcome back to more episodes of Fear the Walking Dead and we are finally at the end of season 3. This is episode 16, season finale. Um, solely a normal length episode though, it's not an extended one. Uh, where are we going to be at the end of this? I mean, we've left it with Troy's dead. <laughs> and... <sighs> Nick and... His mom are... He, did he lock him in? He locked him in, didn't he, Strand? He locked Madison and Nick in there. Um, and left the, left Madison with the detonator. With everything that the, the set. Uh, they're all here. Are they going to find him? What's going to happen? I've no clue. Let's go find out. Season finale, episode 16. Resistance, you say, Mayor Culpa. Someone tipped off the dam you were coming. It was beyond my control, but all is well now. I told them to secure the dam, and that's what they're doing. Meanwhile, that's not securing. That's killing. Change and arrest nurse. So where does it stop? You should be thanking me that you're alive to ask that question. Because I think you might kill me if you didn't have a choice. That's insane. I never wished you dead. What kind of mother would that make me? I don't know. Honest, maybe. One day you'll have no choice. That's the scary part. One day I'll have no choice. Because one day, Mom, you may have no choice with me. But it's also a source of her strength. I don't know. I don't know how I feel don't about it anymore. Us. You are stubborn. <laughs> You had half your face blown off. How are you alive? I don't see how he's in any condition to even leave it. I thought he was done. I made my living holding others to the light. Strand helped my family escape from Los Angeles. And you didn't acknowledge him because you felt indebted to him? Yes, we've gotten to know him. One of Strand's deal points for letting us in. Mm hmm We'd spare a woman by the name of Madison. Your mother was a part of a larger negotiation. And that negotiation collapsed. Hey! Hey! Okay. Wait, hey! Easy. and Daniel took you in. They gave you sanctuary. Temporary sanctuary at best. Proctor John was coming. I made a deal for your protection. You made a deal to save your own ass. And I told you to get Madison out of here. I told you to leave! Why? It's how I move you through the dam. I'll walk you out right under their noses. Please, put on the damn uniforms. <laughs> he died pretty much straight away. <laughs> I don't see how anyone makes it out of this season finale away from all of this in one piece. I just don't. Get out of here. You could just find her now and take it with us. No. That's what I know you want to do. <laughs> just like that, so. Oh, okay. She's just going all in. Yeah. Yeah. That was her final stand. I am mystified. I can explain. Almost got him out. I'm sure you can, but I don't want to hear it. I was going to kill them myself. <laughs> this one was with another white boy at the bazaar asking questions. Is your friend here, Nick? No, he's dead. My mom killed him. Hmm. Really? He killed your son's friend. There's more threat than friend. Uh -huh. I have to kill her because I'm going to kill her brother. But you, mother killer. You bear witness. There's no one to come to the rescue. Say your goodbyes. Thank you. Enough. 
There's an end game here, Proctor. One on which you did not plan. Lola and Daniel didn't have enough guns to defend the dam, so they wired it with explosives. That is true. Oh, shit. No more lies, Proctor. You got a hole in your pocket? Uh, and that's what he took. <laughs> I knew he lifted it. Says it's armed. Tell him to put his gun down. Put your gun down. Watch him move there. My mom and sister are gonna take a Zodiac across the lake. Nick, don't do this. Just go as far up river as you can. Detonator has a range. If you go with them, you lose your leverage, right? I'm not negotiating, John. This is my suicide note. It certainly seems to be. Mm. Go. Not exactly got a lot of Because you have no choice. It. If you don't go, we all die. So, just go. Victor, get in the boat. You wanted mercy? Here it is. It's all right. There'll be time to find them later. You don't survive this. I'm interested to see how it all plays out, though. It's not well for you either way, I'm afraid. That detonator real. Let's find out, shall we? Because that will that. If this blows, they're done. They're buried under tons of concrete. Are you me? This asshole's death warmed over. <laughs> ah, well, you underestimated him, didn't you? He don't fuck about with Daniel, does he? For the dam, the river flows. You think folks want them to fight over what they bottle? Come on, Nick. Civilization's born of violence. It's a great truth. I killed the last man who spoke that truth. <laughs> War was waiting to be realized by us. A quandary. You Just blow the damn thing to your get family clear. won't make it. Didn't consider that quite, did you? It's gonna finish him. He's not gonna get after this. I still don't know how this is going to play out. I'm, I'm trying to work out what will and won't happen here. Time's up. They're coming for it. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Here he is. Nice <laughs> shot. I was going for a heart lung combo. Oh! Not a game changer. His brain's all over the floor. As for you. Well, shit. Young Nick. See, I didn't see that happening. You're bluffing. Fine. I'm bored. I Kill love... Him. I love how you're trying to make it look like you're not concerned. There's nothing you can do no! when no! you've got a sniper oh, on range. No, Nick. Just wait. There it goes. Get drawn into the flood. If they don't step on it. They're full throttle. That's gonna give way in a minute. How is the whole thing not falling yet? If the writers and the director were trying to give you something as the viewer here with this, I don't care. <laughs> Sorry, I just... This is just her fighting her own demons. Concrete dust in it and God knows what else. The sun. Are you kidding me? Okay, guys, um, 
You know, I'll tell you the truth. I won't sugarcoat anything. What the fuck was that? That could have been a really good, explosive, action-packed, exciting, I don't know what's going to happen next finale. And it kind of was, to a point. But the whole Madison bits in that, with her in the barn and the Christmas thing and, and her floating underwater and... and um, her ex pulling her up and put, if that was their attempt at trying to be autistic as well at the same time failed completely it was just doing my head in okay so she's alive where's Strand where's Alicia where's Nick where's Daniel you're just gonna leave us wandering I'm assuming the rest of them in the boat are okay and have washed up somewhere um I didn't know if he was gonna blow the dam or not he did and that was an explosive finale kind of that I was expecting. But mixing it with all that, not my cup of tea at all. Um, so we'll be back for season four and see who is actually alive and who isn't. Um, Nick and Daniel being still up there. I don't know. I mean, so far, Daniel seems to have just been played the Terminator and is an indestructible. So, who knows? <laughs> no idea. Um, if I had to hazard a guess, Nick and Daniel made it out somehow. Um, and Alicia and Strand and Madison have all washed up because they couldn't out... Um, maneuver the, the riptide that that was causing and dragging everything back in with the explosion um but the whole loyalty thing with strand went pear-shaped the minute he took the detonator off him he was wanting that for that to be his final i've got a plan moment and nick took control of it um and he was, he was ready and willing to die to let the rest of them go. His Proctor John was an absolute arse and he's no different than any other bad guy. I just want control of it all and I'll just shoot anybody who doesn't agree with me. But I don't know what you guys felt about that, but the way they opened that episode in the first minute or two with the whole Christmas thing, I was like, oh no, please don't do this. If you're going to give us some foreshadowing of something and it's all people that survive, that's one thing. But all that was doing was just reiterating Madison's conflicted um, thoughts and, and memories and what she's done and what she hasn't done and who she killed and who, what, what she's done and why. All in the name of trying to protect her family in her own mind. But finishing it out like that with it, ugh, bleh, no, didn't like that. Um, I really hope we start on a high point on season four, because we're, as far as I'm concerned, we've just left season three on a down low. That was, it was okay if you took all the Madison bits out of it and showed who survived at the end or even if you didn't and you wanted to leave that as a shock or moment for people wandering for season four that's fine too but mixing that in with it i didn't feel it so there you go there's the truth um i will see you for episode one for season four next all of these are available over on patreon uh, i would very much appreciate it if you would give me a sub to the channel if you haven't already check the links in the description if you do want to head over there and, and watch any of the full length episodes uh it would be very much appreciated it helps support the channel and helps me to continue doing what i'm doing um until then i will see you for episode one of season four take care Don't...